Hi everyone, my name is Christy and I'm one of the physical therapists at OMPT Specialists. Today I'm going to go over an exercise that you can do to help improve your mobility and flexibility in the thoracic region. The thoracic region is the area of the spine that starts just below the neck and extends down to about the bottom of the rib cage. This area of the spine has a tendency to become stiff, especially in the upper to middle part of it. There's multiple reasons why this area becomes stiff, but one reason may be someone's posture during the day. So right now we have a lot of people working from home and probably at workstations that don't facilitate a good upright spinal alignment. If you aren't conscious about your posture during the day, you may find that you have a tendency to slouch. And if you do this day in and day out, you may start to notice some tightness in your mid back and even some tightness in the front of the chest. Over time, as you develop increased tightness and stiffness, it gets harder and harder to bring yourself back to an upright position. This can lead to problems in the thoracic region, but also can contribute to problems in the neck, and the low back, and even in the shoulders. Because of this, it's very important to maintain flexibility in the thoracic region, and to really be conscious of being in a good upright position when you're sitting, especially if you have a job where you have to sit for prolonged periods of time. So the exercise that I'm going to go over is going to focus on flattening out this curve and stretching the muscles in the front of the chest. For this exercise, you will need a long foam roller. That way you can sit at the one end and your head can be supported at the other end. You're going to set it down on the ground, sit down on the one end, and then lean back so that your spine is supported on the roll. You may have to adjust yourself to make sure that your head is also supported. If your neck's uncomfortable at all, then place a pillow behind your head and neck to support it. Your feet are going to remain on the ground and your knees are gonna be bent. And this is gonna help with your balance and also help to reduce pressure on your low back. At this point, then you can bring your arms out to the side until you feel a moderate stretch across the front of your chest. You will also assess to make sure that you don't have any pain in your shoulder, your neck, your back, or any sort of symptoms going down your arms, such as tingling, numbness, burning, or shooting pain. You can then vary the arm position so that you can stretch various parts of the muscle. If you do find that you're really tight and your arms don't even reach the ground, you can bring a pillow and place your hand and arm on the pillow until your flexibility improves and you're able to get your arm down to the ground. I would recommend doing this exercise daily for one minute to five minutes. If you do notice that you get any sort of pain during it, then reposition your arms and see if the pain goes away. If it does not, then discontinue the exercise. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out and contact us and we can schedule you for a free consultation. We would love to hear from you.